Hi, welcome to another video. I'm Ron and this is a special one. I'm going to show you my new watch, which is the Boom Immersia GMT. I hope I pronounced that correctly. So I was actually using a Chrono B Apex with a Sapphire Crystal, the smartwatch, the hybrid smartwatch. Now I'm shifting to this. It's a GMT version and I apparently love it a lot. So I'm going to show you this watch up close and my thoughts on using this on a day-to-day -day basis. I've been sporting it for the past uh, week now or so. And trust me, it's a beautiful watch. So before we begin, do subscribe if not done so already. I'm Rod. Let's get started with the review. Looking at the watch, this is a 43mm case size. The dial you can see is blue in color. It changes the color tone as and when sunlight hits it, which I really like. It seems like more there are more shades to it than just simple a single tone blue. It's got the hours, minutes, and seconds, and they have a date function. This is the power reserve indicator, and that's a GMT clock. Talking about the strap, this is an alligator skin black leather strap. It's lovely to the feel to the skin. The crown has a logo. At the back of the watch, you can see it has some branding of Clifton. You can see the movement. Let me just focus that. Yeah, there are 28 rubies used in this particular movement, which is nice. The watch strap is a two uh, clasp function. First one closes here and the second one overlaps it. You have a lever here to actually open the watch strap. It is simple and it's nice. Even on the watch strap, you see the branding there, Boom Immersia, stainless steel. A lovely watch, I picked it up for 3,20,000 rupees out of India after a good discount. I'm happy with this purchase. I'll let you know my comments after usage in another video, say for a month or so. I'm going to be wearing it for close to a month now. Let me know what you think about this watch, whether you're going to pick it up or not. I'm Ron. This is the Venus Life Studio channel. Thank you for joining in. Talk to you in the next one. Bye-bye.